Welcome to Drills Mode. When selecting the drill button, you have the ability to create your personalized drills. Once they're created, they're saved in your favorites and your personal account for you to use later on. Now we're going to go ahead and create a personalized ground stroke drill. In the first screen, you'll have the ability to choose any strokes, volleys, forehands, backhands. If you're using a ball machine or a feeder, you can select that as well. Right now, we're going to go ahead and create a drill with player A and player B using any stroke. We're going to select any stroke to any stroke. Click Next. You will get a quick tutorial showing you how to press the buttons of the zones that you are looking for. I can take my finger and select the whole baseline area. Maybe I want to create a negative if the ball is out and if the ball is in the net. And anything short, we're going to award one point. I have the ability to copy that zone, and we immediately copy that. If I want my opponent to do something else, I can clear it and then select, hey, I want you to only to, to play deep balls. We can add drop shots by sliding open drop shots, and we can add doubles alley to this equation. We click Next. We can select whether we want this head-to-head -head or teamwork. And we have the ability to go into our advanced setting. Here we see the ability of using a set minimum speed. Once we open, we can award higher numbers or lower numbers. We click Next. And if we want, we can add also height over the net by selecting two out of the, th the three, zero to two, two to four, above four. We click Next. We're going to say this is head to head. Next. Now you have the ability to select it by time, by points, or freestyle, which would be in a limited number with no goal. We click Next. Now we have the ability to also rename this drill. We can call this Any Stroke. Deep. We can save and start. Or if we just had some spare time and we wanted to create new drills to add to our archive, we can save and create new drill. We're going to start this drill. And because we choose head-to-head, -head, we see our two counters on, on side A and on side B. We have the ability to switch sides. If we're going to keep going and switching sides, we can stop the drill. We can restart the drill. We have the ability to use our instant replay button. We can get out of this drill and change drills. You can turn on or off the counter and the line calling as well as the sound. You can view your quick stats. And once you're ready and done with the drill, we click Analyze, and we can go and review our session. Now we're going to go ahead and create a customized serve and return drill. Here you have the ability to select any serve, first serve, second serves, any return, or if you want to focus on forehand return and backhand return, you can do that as well. Here we will simply focus on any serve to any return. Now we have the ability to select where we want to serve. We can award two points to a ball that was deep, and we can award one point for anything that's short. Anything that goes in the net is a minus one. Now my returner, I definitely want him to serve deep. Okay? Anything short, we're actually going to award that a minus one, or else we will get attacked. Here we also have the ability to open up our drop shots and add the doubles alleys if we want to. We're going to click Next. We have the ability to choose head-to-head -head or teamwork and set an advanced drill setting. So here for the server, I'm going to 
look for him to serve at least above 85 miles an hour. We'll let the returner stay the way it is. We're going to click next, but maybe I want my returner to also hit high over the net. So we're going to select the 2 to 4 and above 4. We can again do this head to head or do teamwork. We're going to choose head to head. We click next. And now we can do it by time. Two, three, four, five minutes. Goal, 10, 20, 30, 40 balls, or freestyle. We're going to click next. We have the ability to save and start the drill, or we have the ability to create a new drill and save this. We're going to rename it. Serve and return. We're going to save and start drill. Once again, you will see your counters, who is playing on side A, side B, your switch sides. You can switch strokes. This gives you the ability for player B that is returning to become the server. Stop drill, restart drill. View instant replay and keep the video recording. Change the drill if you want to get out of it. You can turn on and off your line counters, your line calling and your counter, the speed of the serve, the sound, analyze your quick stats, and eventually analyze. Once I've created my drills, it'll be stored in my personal account. I can click My Drills, Now I can view any drill that I've ever created in time. If I have some favorites that I always use, I can click the star button, add them to favorites, and here will be my favorite drills. You have the ability to edit this. You can edit the drill, you can rename it, and you can also remove it. If I decide this is the drill that I want, I click start. and it sends me over to start the drill.